Hello and welcome to Rookie's World. I'm Rookie and today we're going to be doing a dorm haul. Um, I'm not going to film this all in the same clip because my mom got a call to go on. But I'm going to show you how much stuff I have, like condensed into stuff. Um, one thing I'm not including in this is my clothes because I just wash all of them and I need to put them back. Also, I don't think you would need to see my clothes. So anyway, here is everything condensed. This is everything. We've got a couple suitcases. That stuff is not included. Oh my gosh, this camera. I need a new phone. Anyway, um, we got a few suitcases. You can see my like comforter. Got a book bag. Some bins. Some baskets. A huge bean bag. <laughs> uh, a little lamp. And I got a water bottle down here. Um, my colors, you can't really tell yet, but my colors are lavender ish um like peach pink like that kind of pink white and gray so whenever my mom's off her call and if i can find a better camera i can show you everything yeah i have a lot of stuff as you can see um as i said in my previous clip my colors are lavender we, we strive for lavender, we get somewhere in between. Um, gray, I have light gray, I have medium, do I have medium gray anywhere? Yes, I do. I have light, medium, and dark gray. Um, white, da da. And like a peachy pink, it's over here. It's right here. You'll see it later. I think it only, I think I only have the peachy pink in that basket. Um, a stuffed unicorn that I'm bringing. Maybe I'll explain that later, maybe not, I don't know. Um, and then I'm making my wall art um, for my room, and there's like a peachy pink on one of them. So, you're going to see me going up to the camera a lot, that's because I have to pause on my phone. I have to pause the video on my phone and then come back. So, I'm going to pause it, I'm going to get some semblance of order, and we're just going to do this one item at a time. Matter of fact, I'm not even going to pause it yet. We're going to do this first because I had to stage it. The food basket. <laughs> um, it's purple. Not quite lavender. It's like a dark lavender, if that makes any sense at all. Probably doesn't. Anyway, this all goes back in the pantry except for these two things. Oh, ooh, ooh, what am I knocking my water? Jeez. I'm a mess over here. Anyway, I had to stage this so it would look cute with it for the thumbnail. Look like it's got food in it. This is going to be my food basket. It's going to have all my snacks and stuff that are just for me. What I'm also going to do is, hopefully, um, my mom and I are going to try to find one of those like big drawer sets. Like, not big, but like medium. Like, fit under my bed type. Like, maybe two what's it called? drawers. Um, and one of them will just be my guest drawer. I saw this on somebody else's video. Oh, I don't remember her name. I do not remember her name, but I saw on somebody, because I watched like 20 other dorm halls <laughs> before we even started shopping. Like as I was making my list, I watched like 20 other dorm halls from last year and the year before that. Um, so it can keep it kind of recent. Nothing's going to be as recent as this because COVID said, hello, how you doing? Um, and this is unprecedented. So, oh, there's also a lot of stuff because I know I'm going to be in my room a lot and I need something <laughs> In my like, I can't just have like nothing in my room. That's not gonna work for me. Not gonna work for me. So, I have a lot of stuff. I also have two friends that are coming to school with me. One of them might be doing online now, but we'll see. We'll cross over when we get to it. So I also have sweet mates. So that's the main reason I've got this big unicorn up here. It's a bean bag. You can sit on it, you can lay on it, you can do whatever on it. Um, and I got that just so if I have people in my room, they have somewhere to sit. Cause I don't like people sit on my bed. I think somebody's trying to come downstairs. Okay, maybe not. Anyway, let's talk about the water bottles. I'm going to a little bit forward. So, this water bottle, I have had my entire senior year of high school. I think it's only that young. I don't know. It's barely scratched and scraped, so it was, you can tell it's recent because I'm rough on stuff. Um... Yeah, so it's Contigo. It's got a little thing right here. You press the button. Boop. 
there's a straw. Straw goes down here, and it's 32 ounces. Click it back. Oh, then the part where you click it is really rough stuff. What do I do? What do I be doing? Like that's my question. What do I do to these water bottles? Anyway, you can take the top off. You fill it like that. And then this other water bottle. I bought it. How many days ago was this? I bought it recently within the within the last two weeks, maybe. Um, this is by Hydra Peak. It's purple. It's got a handle. The handle doesn't move, which is good for me because, as I said, I am rough on stuff. Um, I had two other water bottles where the handle didn't move, but it wasn't this big, so I could put it on my finger and like swing it, and they both broke because I dropped them too much. So, good sturdy handle on this. Um, how you open it? You just kind of like twist this part up here. Hi, mom. You can come. You can come over here if you want. My mom's here. She's leaving, leaving on the mid morning train to Inishu. I don't know if they can hear you. Anyway, um, you twist the thing and it opens like that. You drink out of this part. No, um, okay. And then, and then close it like that to fill it. You just open it. There's no straw. It's just metal. My mom doesn't like metal. She's making a face. Do you want to come over here? No. Do I need to be over there? I mean, if you want to. If you want to add your commentary and make sure they can hear you. Who's talking? Who's hearing me? Your video? Yeah, my video. Anyway. She's leaving. Leaving. Okay. <laughs> Okay. Anyway, I have two water bottles because oh. what she said, oh, because I bought this one and she kept telling me not to buy it. This one's also 32 ounces. I didn't mention that. They're the same size water bottle. One is for inside the dorm and one is for when I leave because I tend to lose stuff and I tend to like, like if I only have one water bottle, it will never be filled because I'm always guzzling water like a fish, which I, that expression never made sense to me. But we'll talk about that later. Anyway. Um, I always like guzzle water, so if I have two of them, one of them will always be at least half full. I'm planning to keep, like, all of this stuff for as long as I can. Um, maybe I'll change a few things here and there, but, like, this water bottle will be my water bottle, hopefully, like, well into, like, when I start teaching. Oh, I'm going to school to be a teacher, early elementary. Um, I might, mm, we're not gonna talk about that now. Okay. I want this to be my water bottle that, like, my first class through my, like, fifth class knows that this is my water bottle. You feel? So, I got a good sturdy one. I didn't explain that in the store, because stores are overwhelming, but two water bottles. This was probably not gonna last the next four years. It's already rough stuff right now, a little bit at the, at the part that I opened, but this one is sturdy. As I like to say, it is rookie proof. I, like I said, I'm rough on stuff. So I'm going to pause it, and I'm going to come back with a lot less on the couch. And we're going to take this, like, one thing at a time. Tell all you. Tell okay. all you did. That's my mom. Okay. She's going away. Ah. Maybe not for long, but she is going up here. Um, so, we're going to start with my book bag. So, a little bit about this specific book bag. Obviously it's purple, it fits into my color scheme, but um, every year since I was really young, I don't know what age, but since I was really young, my grandpa would take me and my brother back to school shopping. Every single year we get all new stuff, new book bag, new paper, new pencils, pens, pencil case, scissors, all the works everything brand new because you know kids are like rough on stuff so you might need to replace some things every year but I wanted to replace everything just the kind of person I have always been I like to go into new situations with new stuff you feel um that and I love stationery <laughs> even as a kid I love stationery so I just was jumping off the walls to be able to um like get new stuff but I told him when I was like eight, I was like, when I go to college, I'm going to get a purple book bag, and I'll get, that's going to be my book bag for the whole college. Like, all of college, I'm going to use that same book bag. 
I held my promise. <laughs> it's also purple and gray, which I thought was very cool. Um, I don't know what other color would be with purple, like this kind of purple, but... Oh, if you hear a little bit in the background, my dad's in the garage. He gets kind of loud with his, like, music and stuff. He's a DJ, so he's got to work his magic. Anyway, purple book bag. Let's go through it. This is going to be so, like, backwards and haphazard, but it's okay. Because life is backwards and haphazard. I'm just living life, you feel? So, first thing, major thing, is... My laptop. It's an HP. I have no clue what the specific model is. I know that it's rose gold. It's very cool. When you open it, the keyboard. Here, let me see if I can show y'all. I don't even know if it's on right now. It's on, I think. Okay, anyway. The keyboard lights up. Okay, come on. Look. The keyboard lights up. <laughs> That's my, um, I was going to say lock screen, but I don't think that's what it's called on computers. Anyway, there's that. I think it's very cool. And, um, one more thing that goes with this laptop is... ta -da! A mouse. Ooh. A mouse. Um, there's a little, like chip thing that goes in here that you have to plug into the laptop when you want to use a mouse with a laptop. Not going to get into the specifics right now. But it's a little mouse. It's rose gold. It's got the little thing thing up here. You can click here, click here. Um, and it runs on one AA battery. It's very cute. It also, if you turn it on, it can tell you how much battery it has left. Okay. Well, that went away very quickly. But there's a blue, like, line telling you how much of your battery you have left. I'm trying to cut it off. Okay, it's off. Um, so that's part one of everything. Also, I'm very sorry. I, like, touch my face, move my face, everything with my face a lot. I've done that since I was little. Um, I, I've been trying not to. It's been tough. It's been rough and tough stuff. Um, but I, I am very sorry about that in advance, if that bothers you or anything. Let's get into the rest of this stuff. So, we have two one-inch D-ring binders. They are from UB. They are lavender. Um, and I did UB instead of the regular, like, Avery brand. Um, I think just because I saw them first. Like, straight up. I think it's just because just I saw them first. Um, here's some paper. Pretty boring. I've had this for a while. Because, like I said, me and my brother used to get new paper every year. So, we have enough paper in our house right now to get me through college. <laughs> me and him. We have quite a bit of paper. Um, and then, I've got two five-subject notebooks. Um, definitely not the same brand. Probably not from the same store. But I've had these since, I think, 11th grade, and I never used them, so why not now? You know, there's no time like the present to use all your stuff up so you can buy new stuff. <laughs> That's not entirely why. I just wanted to use them because when else am I going to use a five-subject notebook? Um, I found graph paper notebook. Very cool. Me and math don't get along, but it helps to have graph paper, at least for me, because then I can kind of, like... And if I'm doing, like, regular math, like, if I'm doing algebra, I'm going to use line paper. Or, like, paper with nothing. But for stuff like polynomials, for stuff like graphing anything, yada dada, I need graph paper. Yeah. And some of this stuff, I, you may, because I want to do this every, like, every year. Some of this stuff, I may be like, haha, I have this again because I didn't use it last year. That's just kind of how I roll. I don't know. No way that was to tell you. Um, in here, as of right now, this is where I'm going to probably keep all the, like, books. And I'm probably just going to get my books online, but I hate online books. I just don't want to pay for them, you feel? Um, so, I like to read as well, just leisurely. So, this might be where I put all that kind of stuff. Anyway, and my laptop charger is going to go in here, I think. I think, I think, I think. Anyway, enough babbling. Got a composition notebook. 
don't know what I'm going to use this for. I've had this since I think the sixth grade, no lie. Um, and then I have a one subject notebook. I like to write like anything and everything. I'll plan stuff that's not school related in notebooks. I have, do I have it? No, I don't. I have one of these from, I think, when did I get that? I think I got beginning of last year. And it is a three subject notebook. I painted it yellow. Big mistake because I, no, no, but painted it yellow. And that has been my notebook since the beginning of this year. All the way through. I'm not done with it yet. But as soon as I'm done with that notebook, this one is stepping in. How you doing? Uh, I might. You know what I might do is just get a new one of these every semester and just kind of keep them. Document my college experience, you feel? Maybe I don't want to, but I will. Hi, Dad. I'm recording again, so if you want to be goofy again, you know, they, they can see you. This is supposed to go on YouTube, though, by the way. He doesn't seem to care. That's my twin. I look like him. My dad, everyone. Okay. So, next up, we, we have some regular, like... Just like typical supplies, you feel? So, um, first, I need to show you. In here, there's a whole bunch of pencils. Not pencils, what they call There's a whole bunch of <laughs> There's a whole bunch of pens and highlighters in here. Because those are going to go on my desk. They're not going to go in my little... That's okay. They're going to go on my desk. I've had this pencil case since 11th grade. This, this butterfly is purple, so I thought it I thought it worked. I thought it would be cool. Um, I've got some index cards. This is not all of them. Um, I grabbed this one because I put purple index cards in the front. The rest of the index cards are white. But I put purple ones in here because I wanted to. Um, and I figured, let me grab that one for the video. But this is not all the index cards. I need an index card holder, to be honest. But I'm probably not going to get one before school starts. These are little bookmarkers. Um, i thinking about it. I'm probably going to do all my books online, so I don't really know why I got these. But I know I didn't need regular size sticky notes either, because I have some, and I didn't want to spend the extra money, you feel? So, I also read a lot on my own, so if I go back to my books, this might be a good way to, like, because all through high school, I had the flag ones where you can't see through it. So, um, I still have some of those. But these will be good for, like, my own personal books. You feel like if I don't feel like using my um, bookmark or I don't get any new ones or I lost it because I lose stuff or I, if I ripped it because I'm rough and tough on stuff, these right here will come in handy. Anyway, I got some regular pencils. The one class I have in person as of right now is Biology Lab. And, um... If I need to take a test or we need to do lab stuff and they're like, bring a number two pencil but but like not mechanical. Some professors don't like that. Some teachers, regular teachers don't like that either. So I always get regular pencil. What else is in here? Um, oh, let me open this and show you what's in here. As of right now, I have one pencil and a bunch of pens. And I will explain why in just a sec. Sorry, I gotta fix some stuff. I'm about to put some highlighters in here right now too. You can see that on camera. Anyway, every year I get a new pack of these Paper Mate pencils. I always get the pink, purple, and teal pack. Those are my favorite pencils. I always start my year with the purple one and end up with the teal because I lose them, break them. And I do theater, like tech theater, a lot. And, um, I just, mm, in 11th grade. I had my like little tech notebook thing, whatever. I was doing my thing. I was doing costumes. And we were having somebody try on shoes. I got up to go do something else because I was working with two other people. I got up to go do something else. I come back and my pencil is on the floor cracked. <clears throat> so, I did three pack. I'm rough on stuff and other people are rough on my own stuff. So, three pack. 
Um, I have these G2 pens. I had them last year, my um, senior year in high school. I am only going to bring these two and the red and blue ones because I like ran my black one to the ground <laughs> um but these ones I really didn't even touch that much and I want to do a new system for like taking my own personal notes because I have to write it down or else I'm not like even if I do write it down I don't remember it but there's some sort of like kinesthetic engagement with it. I'm a kinesthetic learner so you know any type of engagement with the material it'll help me a little bit and I like my notes to be cute you feel like I don't want to be writing something that's boring that's not gonna grab my attention I will lose my own attention I sure will. And I like to doodle, so color pens. Anyway, these are the two little fun colors. And then, this year, they are fresh on the market, I believe, are these swanky little Sharpie S-Gel pens. Does that say S-Gel? Okay, yeah. S-Gel pens. They're very cool. I think that's just the logo, and then it says gel. Sharpie gel pens. They come in black red and blue and blue that right now is all that's in my pencil case but i'm about to change that because i need to put these highlighters in here these are just plain old bic bright line bright light bright some bright something highlighters bright liner i got them for last year and they lasted me a good while you feel like they're, they're pretty good um they're not smudge resistant so i'm always careful with these but i like them i like them well enough so that's what is in my pencil case and that is all this my book bag oh you know what? while i'm here she's sitting right next to me i got a lamp i refer to her as the pixar lamp oh, as the purple pixar lamp because she just reminds me to look There's no light bulb in it yet because I'm rough and tough on stuff. I didn't even unwrap the cord yet because I felt like I was going to ruin it. Um, it's going to go on my desk. It's a lavender lamp. It's from Target. It's from, like, it's by Pillow Fort, which is Target's kids brand. But I love their stuff, okay? Like, stuff like this is this is adorable. And it matches my, my colors. And for, like, big kids, they're like, y'all don't need purple. Y'all can get pink or gray. Pick, pick color. I'm like, no, I want purple. So, no, I don't have all the little like storage stuff on the bottom, but I had enough gray stuff for my desk. So, purple lamp. Anyway, I think what I'm gonna do is grab a basket. I have two other baskets to show you, and then I have two bin, three bins, and then I have two suitcases. The only thing that's not gonna be in here is my clothes. I think I said that already. I did. Okay. Let me move on. Eh, I don't know. Okay. Moving on, we have my cleaning basket. This is the peachy pink I was talking about. Very weird color. So, what we got going on is plastic bags. Do I need to explain this? I don't know if I need to explain this. This is... Okay. Boom. This is where I'm going to keep my stash of plastic bags because, you know, you need them for, like, cleaning stuff. So, that's where I'm going to keep them. I have a 50-pack of masks. It's from Sam's Club, I think. I have this in here. It's not cleaning, but it's just PPE. Um, I don't know where else to put it. Like, it was not categorized anywhere else. So, they're probably going to sit on my desk for real, for real. Anyway, that's where those are. I have a Swiffer, and it's like a wet, dry one, like the regular Swiffer, right? So, um, it comes with three wet pads and seven dry pads, but I bought some extra of each type of, like, Swiffer things. So, I have the dry ones, they're the heavy-duty dry ones, and then on the bottom I have the wet ones, so we're going to get to those. Um, so, I have very sensitive skin. And so I need all free and clear for my, like, for my detergent and stuff. These are dryer sheets because I didn't want to mess with dryer balls. 
Um, this is like laundry, and I have stuff. I have my laundry stuff in it, but we're gonna figure that out. Not today. Like this is just get it to school. We can put stuff where stuff goes later, but just, this is just get it to school. This is gonna be the basket I use for my cleaning stuff. So all free and clear dryer sheets. I'm not sure when I'm really gonna use these though, cause I don't like dryer sheets. But my mom was like, get them, get them. You never know. So I never know. We got toilet bowl cleaner. I think this is self-explanatory. Clean the bowl of your toilet. Um, have a little bit of dish soap, just tiny. Cause I have like two plates, two bowls, two cups, and then I'm bringing I think two forks, two spoons, two not. Do I have knives? I think I got knives. Two two forks, two spoons, two knives. <coughs> oh, somebody on my phone. Let me let me let me do this. Boom, boom. Not oh, ah, no. I'm sorry, I dropped. No, this is all over the place. Anyway, my phone is now on do not disturb. So. A little bitty dish soap because I'm not going to use very much. This big old thing in hand sanitizer. <laughs> it's not even that big. How much is this? This is like, yeah, this is 24.5 ounces. It's very, like, liquidy, watery, but my dad bought a huge sanitizer refill. It's not this brand. It's a different, it's a different brand. So this will not be watery forever. The amount of places that I go for real, for real, this is probably going to mess, this is probably going to last me the whole semester. I go nowhere. Um, and then in here I have, they're very loud, some sponges, because, you know, I'm prob I probably, mm, it's probably going to be one for each year, if it is conked out by the end of the year. I don't know what I'm really going to be using these for, because I have two plates, two bowls, two cups, two forks, two spoons, two knives, and I'm probably just going to be eating cereal. For most of the year. I can use it on the bowls. But other than that. We got a four pack anyway. Because we know we're not going to have to buy them again soon. And by we I mean my mother. I think she. No I pay for them. I pay for like half the stuff. My mom paid for like half the stuff. I have my shower shoes in here. They are pink. They're just in here because I can't put them with the bathroom stuff yet. Like I said we will put stuff together when we get there. But as of right now this is. How do we get there? I'm about to fix the camera again. Chat, this thing is... Okay. Um, I have some command strips. They're irrelevant. This is to hang up my mirror and to hang up the wall art that I'm making. Um, and finally, we get to the bottom. These are the Swiffer wet pads. So, that is my cleaning basket. I'm going to go get you something else to look at. I got... Wow, that was weird. Let me get something else. Alright, I got two things with me. Got two. I'll be like three musketeers. Anyway. Anyway, I'm not gonna sing because y'all don't wanna hear it. Um, so first thing I have over here is my comforter. She's very big. She's got these little like sparkles on them, I think. I thought that was cute. Um, she's gray. And the whole set comes with two decorative pill I mean two decorative pillows, two shams, and the comforter. But I took the pillows and the shams out because I'm not gonna use them. She's gray. One of my colors. Woohoo. Go over there. <laughs> um, and the second thing I have is this other basket. This is not going to stay with me. This is going, like, the basket itself is going back home. Um, but the stuff in it is going to stay. It's mostly going to go in my closet, though. Or, like, next to the closet. So I think I got an armoire since I'm a freshman. They're like, you don't get nothing yet. What the toys? Anyway. Anyway, so, in here I have my Swiffer, I have my ironing board, it's one of them tabletop ones, um, I have a huge um, laundry basket, because I know myself, I don't like to do laundry, I don't, I really do not. Um, there is stuff that I will wash all the time, but stuff like jeans, my bandanas, I'm about to order some head wraps, I think. So those I'm not going to wash all the time, like, stuff that I'm not really wearing all the time because I'm not going out all the time. 
mm, I need a big one to make sure. Um, it's also going to be all my clothes, like, in the whole week. All of my clothes. And, um, I tend to change my clothes a lot. I paint sometimes. I am a messy eater. Um, I'm just accident prone. So, I get stuff in my clothes, like, all the time. That's why most of my clothes ain't cute. Because I don't want to mess up cute clothes, you feel? Um, yeah, it was $7 from Ross, so it wasn't a loss. <laughs> it wasn't a big thing, so... I got a big hamper. Is it really big? I don't know. It's just bigger than the ones that I normally see for college. This is a pillow, as you can see. It is very soft. Um, I do have some like sensory issues, so I like I need to be able to withstand the feeling of this, like for a long period of time. You feel? And this. Yup, this one's sticking with me. This is my road dog now. Oh, dang it. This is my road dog now. Um, the basket itself is from Clever Made. It's one of them that you can kind of like, and you fold it, and then boom. You feel like, this can go right back in the car, but it's not going nowhere right now. I'm gonna put the stuff back in it, and then I will show you. I think we're on to suitcases. We are on to suitcases, folks. Alright. These are the two suitcases that do not have my clothes in them. This one big. This one is big, y'all. Like, it's already thick. Like, it's already thick. But then you can extend it and make it thicker. You know how heavy this thing is? Because it's not, like, my clothes aren't in this, like I just said. They can hear you, Buki. Like, what the... Mm. Anyway. My closet in this, it's stuff for my bed and stuff for my desk. It looks really weirdly packed, but you're not going to see how it's packed. I'm just going to take the stuff out and show you, so. Period. Ugh, that was nasty. Anyway, there's some money to put it back in this anyway, so we're going to get to that one second. Stay in the frame, stay in the frame, baby. There you go. There you go. And then this one right here has all my towels in it um i got this from my church they did a thing where they like packed um all like some college stuff into a suitcase and it was really cool so thank y'all for that you know who you are if you're even watching oh my God. to be honest anyone from the church watching is probably my grandma or something <laughs> so all right y'all boom i got towels on the bottom and some washcloths in there and I got more towels on top so the ones on the bottom are my gray and white towels um so two of them came from the church and two of them came from my mom two of them are striped they came from the church and then the ones that came from my mom have an R on them because you know R Perukia you feel so um yeah. <laughs> um, we have three colors in here. We've, no, we don't. We have four color types in here. We got gray and white, gray and white. Then we have purple and pink. My colors. Um, and then there's washcloths in here too, but I'm not going to dig this stuff out just to put it back in here. So that's what y'all get to see. <laughs> um, while I'm closing this up though, I will talk about that. Um, so, the big one is from a QVC order my mom did when we got suitcases. I think we we're going to go somewhere. Or maybe we weren't. Because my suitcase, my regular one before I got these, is busted. Like, like I've had that one for the longest, like, the absolute longest time. It's just kind of busted. Like, it's not cute, you know? She's falling apart. Poor thing. Can't barely keep her head up these days, you know? So, we got these ones. They are hard shell, they are great, and I love them. Now, <clears throat> let's crack into this one. <sighs> My lord. Alright. There's a lot, there's a lot of mass on this one. Whole lot of mass on this one. So, you open it up. 
the first thing you see is all of my like desk stuff and a couple things that are not for my desk but I need them here anyway I'm not gonna show you what this looks like on the inside okay I'm just going to like do this methodically because it is packed a very certain way and if I mess it up it's gonna take me like 10 minutes to put it back together we don't have that kind of time so first thing in here that I'm gonna show you is a huge calendar it is 18 months it goes from July 2020 to December 2021 so this will last me the whole rest of the semester and then I'll have to get a new one before I come back next semester nice yes it started in July no I do not care because I'm just gonna use from August on no big thing you feel um, next thing I'm gonna show you is you won't see me you were here and see me putting stuff back the way I had it because I cannot I cannot redo this again just can't do it next thing we have this is gonna be the first thing we bring when we go in though so I've got wipes three pack of wipes um these were not in my cleaning basket because we're gonna bring this big suitcase suitcase up first this suitcase is not staying with me neither is that one they are both going home the ones that are staying with me have my clothes in them I'm not gonna show you them I already said that I'm just repeating myself today anyway there's that I have this little mini dry erase board she's purple I think she's cute um, it comes with a um, it comes with a pen on top that you can erase with a pen a marker on top that you can erase with as well and a little magnet I think it's very cute I might put this in my fridge I do have a mini fridge it's in the kitchen though we use it right now so I'm not put it on video at least not right now but I might put this in my fridge I might put this above my desk anyway it's gonna be like desk related you feel desk adjacent anyway so there's that Oh geez, how did I do this? You see, I'm already messing it up. I think it was under here and then that was one top. Yes, yes, we got it. Okay. Next thing I got this from Ross. It spins. It's a desk organizer. It's a lot of pens that I had in there. Um, my scissors are gonna go in here. Markers I have that it's really just gonna be for like when I wanna do stuff that's separate from school, the markers are. Um, my extra highlighters are in here, my extra pencils will be in here. And then the extra dry erase markers will also be in here. It's a little desk organizer and it spins and it's gray and I thought it was cute. Next thing we have is a little desk fan. I like the outdoors, but I do not like the bugs or the smells or the 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 like the feeling of when it's like humid it gets like stick I can't handle that so have a little desk fan so I don't have to open the window um, and if one of my like if my roommate opens the window I mean I, I can't really tell her like close it we share the room we gotta share something so you know compromise you know it's all about communication and compromise anyway now we're gonna move on to the stuffed animals I have this little monkey. His name's Joe the Bro. He's been with me since I was very small. I take him on all of my like trips, um, and I start. I take pictures of him at every like every place we go that's out of state. Um, and I figured, I mean, I'm going to college in state, but he coming with me. That's my road dog. You know, that's my bro. You feel that's that's my bro. So he's coming with me. And then if we're if I ever go somewhere and I'm leaving from school to go there, like if we have to go to South Carolina or something, I just grab my dude and we can go, we can bounce. <laughs> ah, woo! Um, I'm also in the honors college where I'm at, and depending on how this semester goes, or depending on how next semester goes, I'm at, um, we like I'm expected to be doing stuff like big professional stuff outside of my regular school stuff. So if we end up going on trips, I'm bringing my dude. Second thing is a beluga whale and it's got hearts on it. Um, so me and one of my friends from high school, 
that sounds so weird to say like my friends from high school whatever me and one of my friends from school i call her my school wife um for valentine's day junior year and last year we got each other gifts and so last year i got us these little matching beluga whales I thought it was cute last oh not last we got two more oh i didn't even show i didn't even show y'all the rest we're gonna finish up animals and then we're gonna move on so this is a nora um I don't know if Nora's a boy or a girl, so we're gonna say they. Um, it's a little ty toy. I at my job we sell these little things, so I got a Nora. They're coming with me. I really just got it because it's cute. No other reason. Um, then I got this thing, my pudgy buddy. Oh, one of my best friends. Um, she got me this. I think as a grad gift, and it's very smooth. It's like squishable, and so like when I have a tough time, I need something like, like doing my hands. You feel? Otherwise, I gotta do all sorts of stuff. So, she got me this. It's very cute. Um. Oh, my voice. It's okay. I love this thing so much, and I love her. I'm gonna miss her. She went to school out of state. I'm like dog. I was supposed to go to school out of state too, but that didn't work out because the money wasn't right. Anyway, I got some more dry erase markers to make my board pretty, to make it cute. And then if my sweet mates want to write stuff on it, they can make it cute too, you feel? Um, and then I have <laughs> a picture of me as a baby in a little frame. I'm going to put it on my desk, I think. And then I might change out the picture. I don't know. Anyway, continuing with, like, desk and drawer stuff, this is the last thing. I have this set of drawer organizers. So there's two of these little ones, and then... They are inside of a big one. That is all for suitcases. Let me go ahead and put this stuff back. And then we are on to our first out of three bins. Oh, matter of fact, no, I'm not done with suitcases because I have another side of this. I'm going to be stuck and I'm going to put this stuff away and then I'm going to open the other side. Yeah. Okay. Is it? Yeah, okay. So, I have my bed stuff in here as well first thing is these pillow protectors um it's just to put over your pillow so that it's not nasty because i mm, cannot explain to y'all how nasty people can be i don't want that on my pillows and i don't want like dust mites or anything or like if i like sweat in my sleep i don't want that on my pillow like on the pillow pillow on the on the, on the case i could just take it off and replace it I got two of the same one but on the pillow that's nasty so we got that we have a mattress pad two reasons one comfort two people are nasty you are going into a dorm and you're gonna be on a bed that is not necessarily like built for just everyday living you feel um, like if that bed is hard and people have been on that bed People have done things on that bed. I don't want to be a part of that. I don't want that as a part of me. You feel like I no. So mattress protector. I mean mattress mattress pad. I need one of the mattress covers that you like zip it in. Um to keep that in place. And to like what it is you repel dust mites, it keeps sweat off, it like all the nastiness, it just it it helps protect you from that. So I'm gonna need one of them. My mom and I are going to go to the store and we're going to get one. Next thing, I got this from Walmart. It is a bed sheet set in a little sack. It's purple, lavender, one of my colors. It's cute. We're going to put this on the bed. I also have one pillow. This is going to sound weird, but I do not sleep with pillows. I just kind of bunch up a blanket and put my arm under it and then on the blanket. Not very good for my neck. So, we're trying to remedy that. I got a pillow. Also, because I have a big white pillow for my bed, I have that big gray pillow I showed you for my bed, but I didn't have a big purple pillow. So, I'm going to put the purple on the pillow, and we got a purple pillow, you feel? Okay. So, now we're done with his <laughs> suitcases. Oh, no, we're not. Y'all don't... I be forgetting stuff all the time. Okay, let me... I got this. It just arrived today from the mail. It's very cool. It is 
a lavender um, blanket for the end for the end of my bed because I have a gray like comforter set and then I have a huge white pillow and I don't have the purple pillow but I wanted my main color to be purple so here we go this is gonna sit on the end of my bed and just kind of be cute like it's not even about function it's about cute at this point at least with this thing it is look at me I gotta stuff it in here like that okay I have one last thing in the bedding department but that will be with that will be when I do that and big behemoth back there so you don't have to hang tight for that let me go ahead and get the first bin all right we have hit the 45 minute mark and we've got bin number one of three Oh we almost done. Not almost, but we getting close. So, as you will notice, this bin has a blue lid. Because at first I wanted my colors apparently to be like teal and something. My mom said I said that at like earlier this year. My favorite color has been purple since I was six. I don't know what I was talking when I told her teal. Anyway, the lid doesn't like clamp on, it just comes off. I've got some jackets and stuff in here, then some clothes that I'm going to hang up. But I'm not really going to show y'all, show y'all. If you catch a glimpse, that's a glimpse. I don't care. But like, I'm not going to go through and show y'all all this stuff because we got we got time. I mean, who got time to be doing that? We got things to do, people to see, and places to be. You feel so? I mean, not really. The only place I got to be is my kitchen. But it's whatever. It was. It's, it's whatever. So now that that's out of the way. This one is not that full of like regular stuff because I have two purple ones that are going to be full of regular stuff and they are going to sit under my bed. This thing is going home. It's going right home. Right after we finish. Anyway, I've got like four things in here. I have light bulbs for my lamp. I have a toiletry bag for toiletries. I'm not going to go through this for real for real. Like, y'all don't really want to, I don't think y'all really want to see like mini Vaseline and a toothbrush. Like, I don't think y'all want to, what is in here that would be worth, like, noting? Like, it's just, it's sanitizer and extra toothbrush, lip balm, blah, 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 blah. Like, it's a toiletry bag. I don't know what to tell you. This is what I'm going to refer to as my, um, beauty box or beauty basket because it looks, like, it sounds cute. Um, here, let me... Move, move, move right out of my life. Okay. This is disorganized. This is what it looks like right now. In it, we have stuff for my hair, like my spray bottle, um, and what else? Whatever. Stuff for my hair. We're going to have a representative from each category. So, representative for hair, spray bottle. Representative for makeup. I guess. This is a pack. This is the pack of brushes. Um, yeah, just a pack of brushes. They're they're used. I'm not really gonna show you show them, but whatever. Um, and then we have like extra stuff for hygiene, toothpaste. Um, and we've got medicine. It's my like Allegra that I take every day. But we also in here have Tylenol and Motrin, because you never know what's gonna work. Like some Tylenol don't work for me all the time. And some of it's for my guest box thing. And then for like extra hygiene stuff. This is a, just a nail kit. And that's all that's in the basket. We got this basket from Ross. Cute little thing. Ugh. Last thing I have in here is my bathroom basket. So in here, we've got soap, deodorant, facial cleanser stuff, um, toothbrush, toothpaste. Yada dada. That is it for the first basket, except for like my clothes. But as I've said many times before, I'm not showing all my clothes. There's no point. So let me go get the second. I mean, let me go get one of the other two purple bins. There we go. That's like it. Yo, I've been talking to y'all for 49 minutes.
I'll talk too much. Anyway, purple bin number one. It's from Sterilite. Sterilite, however you say that. Trusted brand, trusted company. We've got a couple things. We have surge protector number one. Surge protector number two. And surge protector number three. Now, I don't have the explanation for why there are three. Besides, my mom went shopping. Yeah, um, we have a square shower mat because I don't know what my shower is going to look like, so we got a shower mat. Um, yeah, and even if it is something, mm, let me not say that. Anyway, we got some stuff, feminine hygiene, yada yada, because, you know, uterus problems. I'm just, keep it straight. Um, we've got this big box big old box. Um, I'm probably going to use it as my memory box. It's just going to sit on my desk. Um, it's, it's got the map on it and it's purple. Very cute. Inside of here right now, I've got some laundry. I've got um, some laundry stuff. What else is under here? Yeah. I've got laundry stuff. I just have um, like power pods. I've got a laundry bag for when I need to bring it all home. And I have some shout in there because, you know, like I said, I'm messy, so I need some stain remover, you feel? Um, also, I have this little trash can. Oh, before I do that, I have an extra cord. I have a cord right now, it works just fine. I have headphones right now, they work just fine. But I have an extra cord, and I have extra headphones, I didn't show y'all, but they're just black skull candies, I don't think it's, yeah. Anyway. I have a little trash can. Um, it's got the little, it's got the little like swingy thing. It's not going to swing right now because there's stuff in it. Ooh. Anyway, inside of here, it's just stuff thrown in so we can like condense it out a little bit more. Got tissues, y'all. My allergies, my allergies. They're so bad. They are so bad. I'm gonna need way more tissues than this, but this should get me through. A little tiny bit of time. Just a little tiny bit, like a, like a, eh, you feel like a little shake, like a little shake of salt on the problem. That's not going to work forever, but it's going to work for right now. Um, I have some ice cubes because I like my water to be cold. It keeps me from drinking it all in one sitting. Um, and like, I just like the feeling of cold water going down on my stomach. Really weird, but whatever. I have these flashlights. They are very cool. They have five settings. Let me show you. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, and off. They're very cool. I like these a lot. We, I wish I could have found them in like blue or white or purple. But they were in green, so green's gonna green's gonna work. You know, batteries essential for my wow. There's a feather. Something is shedding. Um, they're essential for something. And I don't remember what that something was. But my best friend, well, not the one that gave me the little toy thing, but another best friend. I got like three of them. Um, one of my best friends got me fairy lights. They're not supposed to come until September. But I do know they are battery operated. So, got some batteries. And just the bottom of the trash can. Nothing special. That's all that is in this bin this was the lighter of the two bins i got one more bin and then i have like four odds and ends to show y'all and then we're through y'all we're almost done we're almost there hang in with me it's all gonna be an hour long video but hang in there i got y'all i got y'all and i forgot to show y'all something so i told you i was making my wall art um i'm gonna do those like threaded canvas things i, I probably shouldn't have said that because i didn't tell my friends what i was doing yet they might have guessed it by now because I put like a little sneak peek thing and you can see where I finished half of it but not the other half. Anyway, with the colors that I did for the canvases, I painted this little R that we've had in me and my brother's bathroom forever. Um, it's very cute. I painted it before, like chevron, but I just repainted it so I can use it in my room because it's cute, you know? Hi, Dad. Oh, bye, Dad. Um, I can use it in my room. Anyway. I'll get the purple bin, and then we'll get to going. This phone better not fall again. <laughs> We're going to throw hands. 
anyway, this is the last purple bin. After this, we've got like four things left, and then we're done, y'all. So let's crack right into this. First thing we have, like I said, I love to read. I have three books from my home library that I'm going to bring. The Hate You Give by um, Angie Thomas. Um, Color Me In by Natasha Diaz and Wilder Girls by Rory Power. These two I have not read yet. This one I have. This one I have read. I've seen the movie for this one, which was butt backwards because I don't like to see movies of books before I read the book, and I didn't know The Hate You Give was a book. My parents just like, hey, let's go see this movie called The Hate You Give, and I was like, oh, period. Okay, let's go see it. And my cousin was in town. I think either I was there, or or. They were both here. Anyway. I was like, let's go see the movie. And then we got out of the movie and I found out there's a book. Anyway, my dad's doing something. Um, so those are books, three books that I'm going to bring. I'm probably going to buy more because I am a bookaholic, y'all. I buy, I will buy books if my, if my bank account says it's okay. Sometimes even if it doesn't. That's okay. I have this little password thing. I it's kind of opened already, but that's just because I'm clumsy. Um, and my nail, I keep my nails long. Bad combination, I know. But this is a little password. Normally, like this is marketed for teachers to use. They could put on like here, like bathroom pass, bathroom pass, nurse pass, office pass, whatever. I have three of the sweet mates. So I'm thinking we can all like put our names on here and we can put this maybe like on the bathroom so we know whose turn it is to clean it. Or maybe we can put it like so we know who is in and who's out, you feel like. Or maybe we can just put it so we know who's home and who's not, you feel. So we'll see if they bite. I don't know. They seem sweet, so maybe they will. Somebody else might have already bought this too, to be honest. But a little passport. I don't know if we're going to use it or not, but I bought it anyway. Um, if we don't use it, I can just, I can keep on, I can hold on to that for like four or five years and then take it with me when I teach. That's slight work. That's light work, slight work. Anyway, I have a dish towel. I have two actually. And they are cat macarons. They're very cute. I love them very much. I love them so much. They're so cute. I, I can't get over how cute they are. If you couldn't already tell. Um. Oh, okay, that's, that's the microphone. Oh, the whistle. Um, okay. Next, I have an iron. It is blue. We've just had this in the house for a while. Um, it's just kind of a blue iron. Hi, Dad. Bye, Dad. Um, yep. <laughs> I have a replacement. Blip, blip, got my mouth. I have a replacement sheet set for the one that I showed y'all earlier. I have, oh, come on, come on, don't do this now. I have a plunger and scrubber set. I'm trying so hard to keep the plastic on this plunger, y'all, but it's falling off. <laughs> oh, so this looks a little crazy. But I have a plunger and scrubber set. That smells like rubber, like like straight rubber. Mm. I'm going to try to press on, but that smell, I can't handle that smell. Um, I have bag clips because when I put stuff in my basket, you know, I don't want it to be like crumbs all over the ground and stuff, ground, all over the bottom of the basket and stuff, so I keep my, like, keep my food fresh. I don't eat chips, but I do eat popcorn, and I do eat, like, other stuff, you feel so. Bag clips, and even if I don't use them all, my sweet face can use them, I don't care. Um, I have my... Two sets. Oh, I'm on. Two sets of dinnerware. Y'all gonna stop messing with me. Of dinnerware. We have one in my peachy pink and one in a dark purple. We could not find a light purple, so dark purple it was. This is the color of the bowls and cups too. So I'm not gonna show y'all the color for real on them. But here's the colors. You can't really see it that well because the lighting in here is weird and my phone is old and broken. <laughs> but. 25 hangers. I have a big gray, you can see it's gray in here, a big gray rug. It was my brother. She's not going to use it anymore. And I get it. This is my dark gray for the room to, you know, 
pull it all together, I guess. Um, I have a couple odds and ends to show you when that I'm done. So let me get those before this camera runs out again. Really? Really, 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 really. Like, is this what we're doing now? Okay. So these last things, I have two of them on a couch. Boom, boom. Because I don't want the floor to get them dirty. Because they're white. They are not going into my room until almost the whole thing is set up. Because they are white. <laughs> um, two things that are not on the couch, though. This is an old vacuum my aunt had. It's small enough that I can keep it in the dorm. It is not purple, white, gray, or pink. But it, it works. That's the most important thing. Um, we have a stool, because I'm small. And to reach the top of the armoire, I'm going to need a stool. And to, like, hang my fairy lights and stuff. Dada dada. Two big things. This one, right here. Here, let me... Because this I can keep in my lap. This is a big bed pillow. And it's got little arms. So you can, like, it's, like, for, for your back. I have scoliosis, so I need back support. This is going to do the job. Hopefully. And then, I have this behemoth. <laughs> um, it's a unicorn. Um, the colors, and it's a little bit of man over here. It's got purple, and it's got, like, pink, and it's got blue. And the horn is gold. Ears are pink, and she's got some eyelashes. Well, folks, that concludes my... Wow. 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 Anyway, that concludes my um, dorm haul. At least for now. I don't know if I'm going to show y'all the threaded canvases. I don't think I will. I might show y'all two because I finished two of them. I might show y'all those, but the other two, we ain't doing it. Um, we're not going to show that. Anyway, maybe this helped you in some way, like, know what you need for college. Maybe this is just entertainment for about an hour um either way i hope you enjoyed the video if you liked it give it a like um and i don't know subscribe if you want i guess <laughs> i'm gonna try to start this youtube channel up it's just gonna be like a mismatch because i do so much like i really i really do a lot of things like i have a lot of little interests so i'm gonna like tap into all of them <laughs> But I think my next video is going to be a baking video because I want to make cinnamon rolls and most of the dishes are done right now. So I really might just go ahead and make cinnamon rolls for my next video. Anyway, this is my real rough and tough stuff. Dorm haul. Hope you enjoyed it. Um, thank you for coming into Rookie's World and hopefully I will see you soon. Bye!